Hey, I'm Robert Reed. Today I'm talking about Cropped, an automatic cropping plugin for Capture One. Now this video is about how to install it and how to and upgrade it once it's a, once a new version comes out. So if you've already gone to Get Cropped and subscribed or got the free trial, then I really appreciate that. And let me show you how to install it. And if you don't have it yet, you can go to getcropped.com and learn more about it or even sign up for a free 30 day trial. So first of all, when you've uh, registered for Cropped or when you purchase it or sign up for the free trial, you'll get a registration code and a link to download the plugin. So make sure that you save that code somewhere and you should also get that in an email. And then once you've downloaded the plugin, all you need to do is double click it and agree to the end user license agreement and should open up this file. And so all you need to do is, this is the plugin right there, just double click it. It goes straight into Capture One. You want to show settings, and this is where you want to edit, enter your license key. Now, this right here, this window, is the Capture One preferences window. You can see this, this is the general settings for Capture One. The plugins are all the way on the right-hand side here, and this is where all the crop preferences are as well. So the first thing to do here is enter the license key you received after you signed up for Cropped. If you missed that in the checkout window, then check your email for a message from Cropped Order Support. Now, once you've entered the key, just click register. And now you are in cropped. So one thing to check though, uh, occasionally, is in the about tab, you can see a little bit more information about cropped, uh, including whether or not there is an update available. And this version, you can see up here, is, tes is version 1.03. And there is actually a 1.1 update available on the Get Crop website. So you can go to this link. Switching back over here to the browser, I'm just going to go to getcrop.com. You can click the download. Uh, switch over to the download page, download cropped, and then just going to open up again. It's just like the first time. Click the license agreement, and then so just like before, all we need to do is go over to the crop plugin file, double click it, and it brings up Capture One. And with this, you now this menu, we didn't see this the first time because now we already have the crop plugin installed and this is just upgrading it. So it's asking if you want to overwrite the current crop plugin. And yes, you do, we want to update that. And you can go back into show settings. Now at the top here, Capture One has not updated its own internal accounting of the actual name of the version that's been installed. So it still says 1.03, but if you go to the about crop section, you see that it is 1.1 is the version installed and it's currently up to date. To refresh this, all you need to do is basically quit it and reopen Capture One. That will refresh the name here on the plugin. But you can always verify the exact version you're using by going over to About Cropped and see that is in fact 1.1 is the current version. And by the way, when you do go to getcrop.com to get your updated version, please sign up for the newsletter. I'll be sending out maybe a monthly or so newsletter about new things happening in Cropped, as well as updates in Capture One and the videos that I'm posting to, uh, to YouTube. So I'm Robert Reed. Thanks for watching.